question for Gennady, Tom, and Abel. If you could just talk about the atmosphere tonight. I mean, you guys, this was your first fight in California. You sold it out. Mostly Mexican-American crowd. You're fighting a Mexican fighter, and they're cheering Triple G. So <laughs> you could talk about that. Amazing atmosphere today for me. It's a big present for me. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's refreshing to, uh, to be on this ride with him and being so humble and having the people really recognize who he is, not as a fighter, but just as a person in, outside the ring. And I think all those chants and, and cheers were not only for the fighter, but for the, the person that he's shown to be. Okay. Francisco? I have one question for Gennady, one question for Tom. Um, Gennady, where did you learn that Spanish? Buenas noches. Abel <laughs> <laughs> talking with me every day. Buenos dias, buenas noches, amigos, like that. Every day he's a funny guy. <laughs> and then Tom, um, uh, from, uh, you told me a couple weeks ago that I mean, maybe it was surprised to see that uh, Step Up sold out that quick. Was there anything tonight that, that surprised you from an operational standpoint? I tell you, the atmosphere tonight was electric. I mean, we knew it was going to be full. We knew we had the bleachers, we had the standing room only tickets. Um, just the, the, the level of the reception. We knew there'd be a lot of fans for Gennady, but that it, it was that much energy as soon as he walked in the arena. And then we had the extra long walk planned for him. And that's really a salute to the fans, the appreciation of them coming out and, and his acknowledgement to that. And so, it's kind of a trademark for him to walk through the crowd, and that's uh, that's really, um, you know, that's what I would say is just the, the level of the intensity of the energy. And as soon as the people saw him walk in the arena, Gennady, congratulations tonight Thank on the great knockout. You said you you know people love you because you said you'll fight anybody, you'll fight Andre Ward, you'll fight Canelo, you'll fight Cotto, you'll fight anybody. But uh, out of all those guys, is there one name you want more than the rest? <laughs> You know, no, for me it's very important just who best middleweight division to, you know, right now. You know, right now Miguel Cotto, he's WBC champion. I respect him, he's great champion. So, you know, maybe, I hope so, fight with him. Because, you know, for me very important who is the best middleweight division or unification fight. It's important for you to take Cotto's title because he, he's considered the best. Yes, of course, yeah. It's very good for my team, for my career, for my fans. You know, just who is who. He's number one.